Hey guys, welcome back to some more Tennis World Tour and part 6 of Season 4 of our career mode. In today's episode, we continue the quarterfinal match of the Australian Open against Milos Raonic. Now, it's been quite a comfortable first couple of sets, you would say 6-1 in the first, 6-3 in the second. Can we make it through the semi-final? Well, let's find out. Third set. New balls. Oh, a nice start for Milos. But uh, thank you for all the support on the series so far, as always. Uh, really do appreciate it. 65 videos uh, I've done on Tennis World Tour now. Um, so not too far away from 100, um, really, which is, is absolutely crazy. But... Uh, Tell you what, Milos is uh, serving quite well at the start of this episode. Obviously, the double fault was a bit of a problem, but um, <laughs> the rest of them are absolutely fine. And uh, for the first time, he edges his nose in front. But, um, obviously, we had a lot of teleportation in the last episode and uh, I'm sure you guys picked up on it in the comments section as well um, so you know hopefully we won't have any of that nonsense in today's episode but, uh, we're certainly playing well at the moment it's uh, very nice to see <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering whether you could do that, <laughs> but you can. An underarm serve, Michael Chang style. I think it was Michael Chang that did that. Should we try another one? What was that? Thirteen miles an hour. Oh no, forty-three. <laughs> Crazy. Anyway, back to the serious stuff. Well, or serious ish. <laughs> oh, what a return that was. But we managed to swat it back and uh, level the scoring at one all. First teleport of the day. Hope you guys are keeping count in the comment section. Oh, what a beauty that was. We picked our moment and went for it. And kept going cross court. So did he. But finally, we opened the face of the racket. And look at that. Clips the line and stays in. That's ah. Fifteen old. Well. Mm -hmm. Well, break point here and for somebody that hasn't been broken yet. In the match, that is very, very important. We're already 2 1 up. Nice. A 
A real lesson in how to serve. Ready, love? Dog shot in there. We haven't seen one of them for a while on this game. Three one here, consolidate the break. Playing very well so far. Oh, come on. Looks like uh, the drop shots are still broken on the game. I, the AI will not attempt to return them. Sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes. That's a nice shot. Well, it's starting to look like Milos is is giving up here, which is a shame. Just as I say, he's given up. Pulls out that sort of tennis. There was no way. Oh. Floored a little bit long. Pity. We are getting a lot more aces than we used to, I have to say. Where did he learn to serve like that? 40, 15. Holding serve with ease in this match so far. Obviously, I had a few break points to save in the first um, set, but since then we've been pretty imperious. There you go. Another hold. 4 2. Um, eight points away. Oh, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Love 15. Mm 
Mm-hmm. Two break points. He's got to keep the pressure. Well, two break points here. Quite surprising how quickly we've managed to do this, and there it is. We're serving for the match in a place in the semi finals. Oh, what a shot! Stupid idiot. Two chances to finish the match. Oh, too much points. Fifteen. And we only need one. A brilliant serve out wide completes an incredibly comfortable victory in this quarterfinal. We win 6-1, 6-3, 6-2 against the world number 8, Milos Raonic. And uh, I have to say we did play particularly well in the match. Um, and, you know, even though our first serve wasn't as good as it usually is, um, we managed to get a lot of winners compared to unforced errors, uh, take a lot of our breakpoint chances and uh, fend it off his breakpoint. So there we have it. Uh, we're through to the semi-finals and I'm not entirely sure who we'll be playing next. I think uh, potentially Dimitri... Uh, no, it's not. It's David Goffan um, who we are going to be playing. It was either him or Kyrgios that we were going to be taking on and Federer is uh, going to be taking on a Dominic team who has made it all the way up to world number two actually which is, is pretty damn crazy as well um, so that's certainly going to be an interesting match uh, in the other half of the draw um, we've made it up to number four as it stands so if we can uh, win this match and, and obviously win the next one against Roger uh, presumably um, you know, we'll we'll have a chance of uh, getting a number one, perhaps. But uh, no, that is where we're going to leave it for this episode. Uh, unless I can find some way to character customise. I don't think we can. There's our stats, by the way, um, in the five matches that it's counted them. Uh, you can see our first serves won 74%. Yeah, our service points one that is. Oh no, no, it's not. It's not. Uh, okay. 85% um, of our service games we've won. That, that, that sounds about right. Um, we've won a, a decent 45% of our return games as well, which is, is great. We've carved up 61 break opportunities and taken 57% of them. Um, yeah, some very, very good statistics there. Um, but yeah, you can see um, that's how long they've been keeping the, the stats. We got the, um, the well, the semi-final of, of Melbourne um, is one of them. And then uh, one title at the, the ATP uh, Champions Final, or whatever they call it. Uh, we have won a lot of the other tournaments as well. We won the Paris Major, obviously, which is the US Open um, already. So, yeah, that is where we're going to leave it, I think. Unless I can... No, that's... I don't think there is a way to do it. Uh, you guys can let me know if there is a way to uh, customise your character um, at this point. And I don't think there is. Um, but we'll do it. At, we'll try after the tournament, and, and maybe there'll be a way to do it then. But yeah, if you have enjoyed that, make sure you leave a like down below. It really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. 
subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more regular tennis content and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.